Hey, this is Fred from The Fly Project, and today I am excited to showcase a brand new material that we have here at The Fly Project. This is a streamer hair, and the neatest thing about this, besides the fact that we've got it in lots of different colors and some really neat blends, is that this is sourced directly from Montana. It is sourced from Montana, it is packaged here in Montana, and we are selling it from our Montana location and online. Um, as well as in our other fly shops in the Northwest. So this uh, EC hair we actually have in 24 different colors. Um, we've got some solid colors like the orange and the green here. Um, of course, we've got purple and white and, or and um, black and gray, blue, yellow, but then we have a whole bunch of blended colors. And these just, they can be used in um, you know, different streamer situations where you can pick the color you like, you can blend all of them together. There's just a whole variety of, uh, of cool looks with, uh, with this, uh, this new streamer here. So it's essentially very much like EP fiber. Um, I just tied essentially an EP bait fish using these two colors here and it uh, it sculpts beautifully um, if if it's any different at all it may be just a slightly bit silkier than the standard ep um, 3d fibers that i've been using in the past um, but i really like the way it uh, the way it works um, one of our other fly shop guys over in uh, idaho just tied some clousers with this um, using some of the blends and they looked pretty good and so again, we're, we're really excited about this, especially the fact that it is a Montana product. On this fly that I tied, I also added, um, this is a new thing that we're just carrying. Um, these are hairline posted eyes. And one of the neat things about these is you can essentially cut the post um, to different lengths depending on your needs. On this bait fish, I really don't need a, need a post per se. Those eyes are gonna match up pretty tight on the hook. But what I do is I take my, uh, my cutters here and I trim that post off almost flush. But one of the neat things is it leaves just a little bump. And so when I've got my glue on there and then I press it in on the, uh, the eyes, I can feel where the, uh, the hook is. So I can get that eye perfectly centered right on the hook and then um, it glues in there very nicely. So it makes it a little easier to, to get your eyes oriented properly. And then if I had, say, a deer hair head, then what I might do is leave that post a little bit longer. And then with that longer post, I can put that into the deer hair and that will give me a little more security. And again, it also makes it a little easier to hold that placement. So once you set that eye in, it's not going to move around on you. So we, uh, we may do a video in the future on how to actually use these eyes in different products, but uh, I just popped them on this little bait fish today and I really like the way they look. So a couple other things I've been doing lately. Um, this is a product that we've had for some time, but I've been tying with it quite a bit and we've been selling these pretty regularly are the uh, EP brushes. And these happen to be the anadromous brushes and they just make finishing off a fly so nice whether you're doing a space style fly for salmon trout steelhead or in this case i'm tying up a fly that's going to be uh, deployed in costa rica for hopefully some giant tarpon and i did my saddles and then i literally just finished off with the uh, ep brush just gives a great look um, we'll push a little bit more water a little bit more dense than just a straight saddle hackle would be and uh, just really finishes off the fly nicely. So love these products. They're all available at flyproject.us. Shop us, give us questions if, uh, if you have any, and we'll see you on the water. See you online, tight lines.